Hi, I'm Greg Young, VP of Cybersecurity with Trend Micro, and I am super excited today to be talking with Adam Brooks, who is the IT Director for Ballard Power. That right. And uh, starting off, um, why don't you tell us quickly about how long you've been there and what your role has been, sort of your progression. Right, so I've been at Ballard for 24 years now. I started there on the infrastructure side, so I would come in, I would take care of the servers, the server room make sure everything was humming along, progressed into management in 2013, and proceeded up to director level a couple of years ago. So long stretch, not a reasonably sized company in the uh, in the Burnaby area. So your infrastructure team can't fool you at all because you've done that part of the business, so that's great. Exactly, I love managing them because I know when they're uh, buying and when they tell them the truth. And cool, which security people like. Um, let's talk about uh, your relationship with Trend. You've had a journey with us. Uh, how did how did that start, and how does that project? You know, we've today? been partners for so long. I do not recall exactly when we we joined it with you guys, but we have uh, Trend for support for scan mail, uh, for Exchange. We've had Trend support for our servers, workstations. Um, we've progressed from the point where I think there was no such thing as a sort of command control console where we would just go in and make sure things were running and we're, whereas now we have the full console set up, a team of three security experts who actually will utilize Trend day to day and protect all areas of the business. We utilize Trend to feed into our seam logs now and to give us more insight to what's going on. So we went from really early in the day when it was just your basic, I don't think we even had a differentiated agent between our servers and workstations, we just had Trend. So I'm a big fan of visibility. I think it's something we don't talk about enough. We've been focused on the bad guys. That's been great, but that mirror where we look at ourselves, try to find things. So attack surface management, how has that been a big deal for you and how is this a game changer for how you, how you tackle things? You know, it's it's interesting because, you know, in the old days it was more, is it running? Um, and, you know, we were worried about, you know, just things like Blaster or some of those old style viruses, whereas now, you know, we've got SOX compliancy, GDPR compliancy, we have reporting to the audit committee, uh, board of directors, so we need to know every aspect of our environment and knowing the vulnerabilities um, comes into play and making sure that we're covered so, you know, we can't find out about these things afterwards, so making sure you're covered all around and then being able to report that out to whether it's the audit committee, the board of directors, or if you do have an incident, you know, being able to report, show that you've done your due diligence to make sure that you don't have these open gap areas. So I think that just sort of plays into the overall picture of how much more complicated things are in the security world now than they used to be. Yeah, and those IT system management databases we had, they were never the source of truth and the security was kind of drawing from those, but now it's the reverse almost, that that's changed. You mentioned consoles, uh, Vision One is now, uh, you know, in play for you. What's, what's your thoughts on that? or? What's been the big change? That's great, because you know before we would find out maybe just through the alerts and emails what was going on in the environment, whereas now we can come in and my security manager and his team can go through the consoles and figure out what's going on. They have behavioral characteristics and things that we had never thought of in the day, uh, and things that are alerting us to vulnerabilities in the environment that we would have never been able to sort of get a hold on before. And then we can take that data from Trend and feed it into our other systems and get one combined picture of, of everything out way that's going on in the environment. Wow, it's, a, it's been a real change, so yeah. it's a common message we hear. Uh, looking forward to the next year, what's uh, the management reporting, that's a thing that we've heard a lot in the industry that's changing. For the next while, what's something that's going to be new for you that you're going to be trying to tackle in the business security-wise? You know, security-wise, uh, I think we're, we're, we're learning how to do more with less. I think one of the challenges for companies like ours that's still growing, right, is, is managing cost and, and working with a partner figuring out how we can collect all of that information and work with it in a sort of timely and cost-efficient manner. So I think for our company, doing more with less is, is one of the plans for the next couple of years. And always, as always, while we're doing that, stay one step ahead of the bad guys. Yeah, that platform consolidation, that's again a common message. So yeah. hey, thanks very much, Adam, for joining us and uh, for talking with me today. So uh, and we'll see you, uh, see you in the next little while. Thanks. Sounds good. Thank, Thank you. you. Cheers.